Mark Abeley, born May 13, 1955, is a Canadian poet, journalist, editor, and nonfiction writer. His latest book of nonfiction is Conversations with a Dead Man, The Legacy of Duncan Campbell Scott, published in November 2013. Born in Warwickshire, England, he moved to Canada as a small boy and grew up in Lethbridge, Alberta, and Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. He attended the University of Saskatchewan from which he won a Rhodes Scholarship in 1975. He won prizes for his poetry while a student at St. John S. College, Oxford, and began to write full-time after moving to Toronto in 1978. He has been a contributing editor of both Maclean S. and Saturday Night magazines, and a regular contributor to the Times Literary Supplement. For 16 years he worked as a feature writer and book review editor at the Montreal Gazette. He returned to freelance writing in 2003, though he continues to write columns on language issues for the Gazette. In 2009 he joined McGill Queen S. University Press as a part-time acquisition editor. He became the first ever writer-in-residence for the city of Point Clare in 2010-11. He has written four books of poetry, two children's books, and several books of nonfiction. The best known is probably spoken here, Travels Among Threatened Languages, 2003, in which Abley features a collection of short stories showcasing people and situations that have been affected by dying languages, which are disappearing at an alarming rate in the era of globalization. Abley poses the question, should anybody care that thousands of languages are at risk? Through his stories and analysis his findings argue that we should care, as languages give cultural identity to groups and help organize the way in which we make sense of the world. While English has become very dominant, in media, the marketplace, and other sectors, in our increasingly interconnected world, Abley argues that this does not mean primary languages like English are any better or more intelligent compared to various local languages at risk of extinction. Spoken here, Travels Among Threatened Languages was shortlisted for the Grand Prix du Livre de Montreal and the Pearson Writers Trust Nonfiction Prize. It was translated into French, Spanish, and Japanese, and was largely responsible for Abeli being awarded the Liver Press Prize for International Authors in Girona, Spain, in October 2009. Abeli has given lectures at Oxford University, Cambridge University, Ohio State University, McGill University, and elsewhere. In 2005 he was awarded a Guggenheim Fellowship for research into language change. His book The Prodigal Tongue, Dispatches from the Future of English appeared in May 2008. It was praised as fascinating in The Times, London, and hailed by William Sapphire in The New York Times. In August 2009 Abeley published a children's book about words and their origins, Camp Fossilize. Abeley has edited several books, including When Earth Leaps Up and A Woman Clothed in Words by Anne Sumigolsky, he was Sumigolsky's literary executor. Over the years he has led workshops for the Quebec Writers Federation, the Maritime Writers Workshop and the Banff Center for the Arts. In 2010 Abeley began to research the complex legacy of a troubling figure from the Canadian past, Duncan Campbell Scott, a poet who ran the Department of Indian Affairs for many years and is sometimes accused of cultural genocide. The result is a book of creative nonfiction entitled Conversations with a Dead Man, The Legacy of Duncan Campbell Scott. In 2015 Cotto Books published The Tongues of Earth, a volume of new and selected poems. It made an implicit claim for Abeli's status not only as a prose writer but as a poet too.